yeah so what is going on guys uh, you welcome back this is your boy forex strategy factory yeah we are here to analyze the market one more time about the usd jpy yeah i believe many of you followed me till this point where this market got to 115 you know i told you we we made the video from 110 when i said we're going to 115 as you can see we go to 115 and from now we're gonna break it down from 114 where is it going the uj now what i'm gonna do now is that we go to the monthly time frame sorry i got one kind of <laughs> flight stopping me let's go to the I'm going to start from this monthly time frame because I love something that can make me really analyze properly. Previous video, I told you we are going up. Yes, so I'm not going to repeat that video anymore. But if you want to check it, go and watch all the video I've made about the UJ analysis. Now we're going up on the monthly chart. Yes, and then where is gonna be the tp the take profit that is the exit yeah we got final exit right here let me make it like 135 i'm not saying you should go and trade this one but this is just analysis 135 we got another one on the monthly like this one here we got 125 yes and then okay this is what we got on the monthly so, if we're going to do something that looks like a stop loss on the monthly, then we can do things that looks like this. Yep, and this is going to be a red color representing a stop loss. Yes, I hope you can see what I'm doing here, guys. Now, okay, I, I see those are my boys greeting me. Now, we're going to go back to the one lower time frame, which is going to be like, um, it's going to be the weekly we see what it looks like on the weekly then we, we can see we still have a good chance of you know <laughs> um we've got a tp here on the weekly time frame and we're gonna make it like um make it green this is the weekly time frame uh tp okay this is it and i'm gonna make it a round figure for you oh sorry let's make it a little bit of round figure it should be around 119 this is 119 i believe you can see 118.824 that is the uh next pivot we are going to be fighting with struggling with okay uh and i think we we got one more one more right here like um we got one more pivot around this zone yep which is around 120 above 120 yes those are the tp of the weekly if we take a look at what the weekly is doing we can see that yep we are actually you know diving up this is weekly weekly trend okay i don't like doing things like making too much of lines and painting but now are we gonna follow this up i believe we should go back to the lower time frame like up uh, let's dive down to the daily daily time frame yep as we going down we're gonna continue analyzing this we can see the daily going up and then on the daily we have a tp and then we have a tp that looks like a pivot right here man this is the daily tp let us make the daily tp a kind of um uh let's say the daily tp is gonna be this yellow yellow line yep we make it on the daily 115 going back to the 115 and then we can do also the daily um what is it this is what we're gonna do until we get to the one hour time frame okay okay i, I believe we don't have enough time to do this anymore but this is just the analysis let's go back down now to the um h4 time frame okay but you will go to the one hour time frame and find anything that is a tool that will tell you to buy okay then you can be buying into a trend that looks like this until we get to 119 okay 119 